Hey guys, here's a quick video of a forge build using a 8 quart stock pot. This here is a blower motor from a dryer that went kaput. The, um, I wired it up so that it would work just plugging it directly into the mains line. It's blowing into the end of my torch there as you can see. It's actually kind of a reddish color but it looks yellow white in the film as I turn up the, the um, gas you can see that it gets more white dial it down this is a more of a reddish color a cherry color but it looks yellow in the film so yeah that's just an eight quart stock pot that I picked up at a dollar store for about ten dollars actually got a half inch rod here stick it in and heat it up it doesn't take too long that torch I built using a I believe it's like a half inch maybe three eighths brass rod and drilled a hole in it, screwed a 030 MIG welding wire, uh, welding wire tip into it. Here we're getting a side view of the stock pot. Yeah, it's just a cheap stainless pot. Cut a hole on the side for the torch nozzle. Um, yeah, and then we just blow the the air from the blower through the torch and it directs the propane into the forge, dragging up the feed there. I mean, adding some more, more propane. I just turned up the nozzle. Get a little bit hotter there. It doesn't take too long to turn these rods, a half inch rod, red hot. There you go. See, it's red with a little bit of yellow on the end. Seems to work pretty good. This is not very deep, so I wouldn't use it for uh, long stuff unless you want to cut a hole in the back end of the forge and feed it all the way through. I have a forge in the background on the upper right there. You can sort of see it. That one's a little bit longer and deeper. It's basically the same thing, a double layer of that kale wool. The lining is kale wool. I've got it double lined. It does get uh, hot enough to melt it if you crank it up to a white hot heat. The pot does get a little warm to the touch as well. You wouldn't be able to hold your hand on it for very long. Uh, but it's not discoloring. So, yeah, it's just a cheap pot. So, there you go. That's pretty much it. There's another view of the torch. Just cut a hole in the side of the pot, and good to go. Hope you enjoy it.